Today, I'm going to share with you the YouTube secrets. Hello guys, welcome. If this is your first time here, I'm Dave from the TVR Universe and I give weekly YouTube tips to help you build your brand. If that's something you're interested in, subscribe now. As silly as it sounds, it might be more obvious than you think. Now the things you need to think about when making your YouTube videos and pushing your channel is, uh, pushing you, pushing you, is thumbnails. Thumbnails is highly important. Now, you know, you wanna be creative, you want to be, find your own style, find your own branding, do a type, find your sort of style that's just sort of just you. Um, by all means, get inspired by other content creators, but obviously don't copy, because then it just looks like you're copying them and they're probably getting the more views anyway. Um, but what I'd say is definitely find your own style. This sort of comes over time, but keep them simple. My, my biggest secret on that one would be keep them as simple as possible. So. Uh, maybe just a picture or a picture with a few words. The ultimate question, do you do picture or picture with words? Keep it as simple as possible. So literally just a picture and maybe just two or three videos. Think of it like a headline on like a newspaper, you know, picture, bam, bam. Now before I get into more YouTube secrets, don't go anywhere because later on the video, I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna tell you actually, um, what is the biggest biggest thing that you need to take from this video, so don't go anywhere. So following up, you know, sort of after your thumbnail, really think about your title, now that goes hand in hand with your thumbnail, but don't just put what you wanna put or what you think sounds good, because ultimately that just won't work. What I'd think is, so say you wanna make a video about your favorite game, or you wanna make a video talking about something that you're passionate about, whatever that is. Type that in into YouTube, and see what searches actually come up. So say you wanna talk about, you know, your favorite PlayStation game, for example, right? Why I like Uncharted 4. You type that into YouTube, and what you'll find, it will come underneath um, about 10 searches that people have actually put in, and you may find a slight variation, and the top three or four are the most searched ones, and then what I would say, don't necessarily make that your title, but put that within your title. So maybe put that in your title and then add like the year you've made it, say like um, the reasons I like Uncharted 4, 2000, um, 2020. And if you want to get even more views, I would add to that um, why I like Uncharted 4 for gamers 2020 because you're approaching your audience, you're pulling in your audience, and that is key. If you want to get a bit more detail on that, I would definitely find and install the plugin TubeBuddy. Um, it is free, there is a paid version as well, but to begin with, use the free one by all means. Um, that's what I use, and that will give you a rundown of how likely it is that people will actually search for your title, so it's very useful to know. Now, what TubeBuddy would do, it has loads of cool features like helping with your thumbnails, your titles, and descriptions. I would definitely say the first paragraph of your description is highly important. Make sure that you put your title in your description and please do not be lazy with your description. It's a place where a lot of viewers will go. So put links to other videos. Um, you wanna keep people on your channel, so links to playlists. Give a reason why people should watch your channel, why people should watch your video, you know, stuff like that. But the first description should be why they should watch that particular video, putting the title within it. And another little, little cool thing I'd add is within TubeBuddy, you can type in your your, um, your title, that would tell you the rough idea, if it's good, poor, very good, excellent. And if it only comes up with good or poor, perhaps just modify the title slightly until it comes up with good or very good or even excellent. And I'll tell you what, it does work and you will get another 10, 20, maybe even 50 or 100 views extra just because you put that bit of extra effort in. So if you're getting value from this video and you're enjoying the content, please give us a like and a share and subscribe to this channel. Think about trends. Now what I mean, I don't mean clip bait or necessarily you know, the biggest thing going on in the world, unless you politically want to get into that, um, or you know, just generally want to say you're opinions about it but I would say just have a brief look look at other youtubers see what they're doing have a look at like um, you know so say if you're a gaming channel or a musician or whatever type of channel you are um, look at other people now don't copy maybe take you know um, be inspired by them whatever if, if you're you know like me I'm inspired by certain content creators um, but if you sort of look at them and think right how can I take what I like about that particular uh, content creator or YouTuber 
and apply it to me and don't just go, yeah, yeah, that looks good. Actually apply it and think, you know what, I'm going to apply that. Now, earlier in the video, I said to you that I'm going to give you an ultimate secret that will really help you with getting engagement, get more views, more comments. Obviously, by all means, make sure that you respond to as many comments as possible. But what I would say is ultimately important if you want to get engagement, more views on your video, which is ultimately what you want if you want more from your channel, unless you're just having fun, which is fair enough. I would say the ultimate secret I'm going to give to you is solve a problem. That might sound like, okay, what do you mean by that? You know, am I, what? What I mean, solve a problem. Don't just make a video winning any. When you make a video, you want to bring value to your audience, but more importantly, you want to solve a problem. So if that's perhaps a tutorial or a review or just giving, you know, showing people how to do something, it just gives a much more value to your video, which is just highly important. Because as soon as you start solving problems, people will be engaged by that, they'll find it useful. People you know, most YouTubers or most people using YouTube are looking for ways to how to fix this, how to do that, how to complete, how to beat a certain boss on, on a game, how to cook a certain, you know, use certain ingredients in a certain recipe. You know, things, you know, think about that. When you, as soon as you start solving problems, you'll get more engagement, more views, more subscribers, and you see where I'm going with that. So if you got value for this video today, please like, subscribe, and if you want more YouTube tips on a weekly basis, ring that bell to get all the latest videos, definitely subscribe, have a great day, and you guys rock.